Hello friends, it's a Costco shopping day. I'm all bundled up. It is negative four degrees right now. Brr, it's gonna be freezing loading the groceries. I did bring gloves. Because of my editing schedule, you may think that these shopping trips are actually really close together, but I have not been to Costco in a full two weeks. So we need to restock on a bunch of things. Let's get inside. Sunny but cold. Parking lot doesn't have too much snow in it. Cold. All right, right when we walk in, they have these fur, 28 inch noble fur wreaths. These things last forever. I love putting one on my front door. I kind of wish they had them at the end though, so that you could fit them in your cart. I don't know if I'll remember to come back. We'll just put it on the bottom and move it around as we go. That'll get me in the Christmas decorating spirit. They've got this uh, Kirkland wrapping paper, three of them for $9.99, which is such a good deal. They're double-sided too, so they each have two different wrapping papers. And um, if you lose scissors like me, this is probably a good thing to be stocking up on, $9.99 for three scissors. Um, we can never find scissors when we need them unless they're like the teeny tiny elementary scissors. I think I'm going to grab these. And they also have this big thing of tape, which is another thing you can never find when it's time to start wrapping presents. $12.99 for six extra large rolls. Just stopping in front of the heater to warm up. So today's shopping trip is a special shopping trip. In addition to shopping for my own groceries, I am collaborating with Megan from Planting Birches, and we are gonna show you the price difference between where we live. She lives in the Midwest, she shops at Sam's Club and other stores. We are gonna be comparing prices on several staple items today, so we can see what the price difference is if we were to buy the same things where she lives and where I live. So make sure after you watch this video, you go watch Megan's shopping haul over on Planting Birches. She does shopping hauls, cooking, recipes, and family content. So I'm sure that you'll love checking out her channel as well. And she has a cat named Lulu who looks a lot like Luna. So check it out after you watch this shopping haul. I am a sucker for white dishes. I love this two piece set, $19.99. You get this square dish and a rectangle. I just feel like white dishes let the food shine. So I always go for white whenever possible. If you're a Disney fan, here's a Disney Corral set. Fun. Um, I guess the bowls don't have anything. Oh, they got little Mickey Mouse. Oh, and you can't go wrong with Pyrex mixing bowls. And then they come with these lids, which are so helpful. Glass. $13.99 for four. That's a great gift for yourself or someone else. I have never seen these at Costco. These are my favorite little extra tough boots. That's a fun thing for them to carry. I love those shoes so much. I wear them all the time, all summer and sometimes in the winter. I'm pretty sure that's an Alaskan thing, the extra tufts. Do you guys have extra tufts where you live? I've seen people in like Washington have them, um, but I think that's kind of an Alaska thing. Tell me if I'm wrong. If you are hosting for the holidays and want something a little bit nicer than paper plates, but don't have enough plates, these elegant plastic ones, we use these for um, my in-law's 50th wedding anniversary and they were so beautiful. So $13.99 for 50 plates, 25 big plates, 25 little plates. It's a great alternative if you're looking for something that looks like a real plate. Ooh, these are new. I've never seen these lamps. It's $139 for two of them. They're actually really pretty. A little more modern than I usually go for, but I love the gold. I'm gonna grab some pita bread, $4.99. 30 count tortillas, $6.29. Okay, this is going to be our first item on our list for things to compare. This is two loaves of just 
regular wheat bread, $6.69. And I'm gonna grab them too, because I need to make some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. $8.59 for nine grain bread. All right, let's compare. A bag of avocados is $6.99 here. And a six pepper bag is $9.99. I prefer these mini peppers. $6.99 and some tomatoes for $8.99. Make sure none of them are bad because last time I got home with some bad tomatoes. Let's compare this price to Megan's price. This is a four pound box of Honeycrisp apples for $13.49 or $3.37 a pound. I grabbed these ones just because they're a better size for the boys. $5.49 or $1.83 a pound. 15 pound bag of potatoes, $9.99 here in Alaska. Ooh, we got this everything chopped kit. We had this in Hawaii and it was really good. $7.99. Also really like this one for $8.49. I grabbed spinach at Walmart this week, so I'm not gonna restock on that, but it's $5.99. Six romaine hearts, $6.99. I actually prefer these littler ones for $5.99. I'm gonna grab this. $5.59. All right, for comparison, a two pound thing of strawberries is $10.99. $5.49 a pound. Three pounds of bananas, $2.99 or $0.99 cents a pound. Let's compare pineapples. $4.49 here in Alaska for a pineapple. I signed up to bring mangoes to a little Hawaiian luau party, so $7.99 for these six mangoes. $2.42 a pound. We haven't had grapefruits in a while. $8.99 for five pounds or $1.79 a pound. Boys will be happy to have those. Cucumber $6.99 for three. Gotta make sure they're good. They're so expensive. It's always makes me appreciate what's in my freezer. $61.89 or $23.99 a pound for a fresh halibut. We had about half that size for dinner last night. 71.49. It's beautiful. We pay for it in gas to go get them, but I don't think we paid that much per pound. Even paying the gas for the boat. And they have this fillet of sockeye salmon for 22.47, 12.99 a pound. Much cheaper than the how bit. We are a hunting family so we do not purchase a lot of protein at the store but I am going to compare the price of beef. For this four pounds of beef it is $24.99 or $6.24 a pound. I see a sample we have to go try it in honor of Everett. Hello how are you? Merry Christmas to you too. Thank you. Okay, these Ghirardelli chocolates are on sale. Hunter likes to give these to his middle school teachers, so I'm going to grab a bag of those. Kirkland chocolate, 8 out of 10. $14.99, just can't get enough of these. Next time they go on sale, I'm like going to buy a ton. Not sure why, but they said that the ham is on sale $5 off per package. I'm gonna grab a couple, put them in the freezer. Half off, you can't go wrong with that. Tillamook cheese, $9.89. Change things up a little bit. Love it when they come out with new holiday raviolis. We've got bells and trees. So fun for $9.89. I need to try this as a sample. It sounds really good. $8.59. Right, I do not buy my toilet paper at Costco because even though it says septic safe, 
our guy that pumps our septic told us it's not the best. So $24.79 for 30 rolls. Let's compare that to Megan's. And then we have 12 rolls of paper towels for $26.49. This is another thing we don't actually buy, but it would be good to compare. $7.29 for 40 water bottles or 18 bottle or 18 cents a bottle. Two boxes of Honey Nut Cheerio pack for $8.49. $8.59. I just realized when I cleaned out my pantry that we we're out of this. It's $9.79 for two gallons of milk. Uh, let's see how that compares. Who here is a fan of eggnog? $9.99 for a gallon. I feel like we usually buy it like once a season, but today's not the day. I feel like eggnog is one of those things where you either like love it or you hate it. Kind of like candy corns. People have very strong opinions about eggnog. Oh, for comparison purposes, we're gonna do a Starbucks coffee, French roast, uh, $17.49 for a two pound bag of beans. Mozzarella stick. I couldn't tell you the last time I ate a mozzarella stick. Very salty. All right, a twin pack of Skippy peanut butter, ten fifty nine, and a two pack of Nutella for thirteen ninety nine. Megan said this is a pantry staple, so we had to compare the price. We actually don't buy very much Nutella, so let's compare the price. Butter, fourteen eighty nine. I recently went back and watched one of my Costco videos from 2020, which was terrible, by the way. Terrible filming. Uh, I realized how far I've come. But the butter was only $7.49. I didn't realize how much it has gone up until I watched that video. Five dozen eggs, $13.89, and there is a limit of two. All right, well, we're back here in the Christmas stuff. Let's do a quick Christmas look around, see what if there's anything new that we need to take note of. Um, these peppermint squares are also on sale, so I'm gonna grab those two, $9.99. Just good for putting together little gift back skits. They've got the Reese's trees for $11.79 for a bag if you're a Reese's fan. And then if you're doing gingerbread houses, these pre-made ones are really awesome. American Girl doll, my like childhood dream, $129. They seem so much more expensive. These probably aren't like the premium ones, but as a child, that seemed like the ultimate doll. Cute little Tasty Junior set, $37.99. Uh, if I'm being honest though, I'd rather them just come and help me in the real kitchen than have a play kitchen. But that's just because that we're at that point in our lives now. Haven't seen our friend Gary yet, but we haven't got up to the front samples. We'll see if he's here. Oh, our big teddy bear has gone down $3.99. Down a hundred bucks. Sorry, bear, you're still not coming home with me. And we bought this Christmas tree last year. It's on sale. We love it. It's actually really beautiful. And these LED lights are really nice. They come in, you can change them from color to white. Tell me down in the comments, have you put up your Christmas tree yet? I'm not quite there. I'm just finishing up a few cleaning projects and then I'm gonna do it. This week I'm gonna do it. One of my children cannot find any of their snow pants and it's only, he's only been wearing them for a week into winter. So I'm going to be looking for some more snow pants for him today. <sighs> We're still gonna look for the other ones but he needs a pair of backup ones. We can't have this happen. He went to school today in negative five without snow pants on. $12.99 a new type of fleece you know I have a hard time passing up fleece I have so many in that color though but it has a they have one in this red plaid and a light blue this does not belong here oh and a black and white I oh, kind of like that one kind of fun $12.99 have this jacket that I really like. I bought this one, but I do like it in the green too, $29.97, which means it's on sale. If something ends in a 97, you know that it's on sale. If it has the asterisk, it means it's going away soon. So those are your 
clues to look for sales at Costco. Ooh, Costco has a four piece Christmas jammy set. It's T Rex, it's so cute. $17.99 for two full sets of jammies. And here's the little pink ones. So cute. You can kind of mix and match them. And this is a two piece set with a robe. How fun is that? $15.99. Everett was wanting a robe. Uh, that might be the cutest thing I've ever seen, ever in this little robe. Weston has a robe that used to be Bennett, so now that they're sharing a room, Everett has been wanting a robe, so that's a good deal on pajamas and a robe. I threw away two pairs of pajamas when I was folding clothes because I think they were all the way back from Hunter having them, and when I like stretched them out, the elastic completely didn't go back in. You know, it loses its stretch, so. He probably needs a few new sets of pajamas anyways, which he'll be getting some Christmas jammies and then these will be, pretty much I'm just buying it for the robe. And then he'll have these new ones too. Ooh, this lounge set is so soft. Two piece lounge set. Also comes in burgundy, $24.99. Hey, these are my favorite socks for all winter. If you haven't picked them up yet, $14.99, you live somewhere cold. I wear them all winter and all summer. They're just the perfect sock for me. Some lentils. Okay, the Madras lentils, I give those a 10 out of 10. And they have eggnog. This is like the perfect amount of eggnog for me. Just enough to get a little taste of the season and then Eggnog always makes me think of my dad. Ten out of ten. I really like these and they're microwavable, so ten ninety nine for an eight pouch. I'm gonna grab those. Hey, these are on sale for eleven thirty nine. They're kind of fun to have throughout the holiday season. These are ginger beers. Ten twenty nine. $5.99. Let's do a couple price comparisons on this aisle. Chocolate chips, $10.99 for a 4.5 pound bag. I'm actually gonna grab those. They always seem to be going through chocolate chips. Especially in holiday baking season. I don't need any of this today, but a 25 pound bag of sugar, $21.49. And a 25 pound bag of flour, $13.99. And a two liter thing of olive oil is $14.99. I love adding these to soups if they just need a little bit more flavor. This is the better than bouillon chicken and better than bouillon beef. And these are $8.29 each. These bottles have gotten bigger. Okay, just checking my list to see what, oh, okay, yep. Let's go look at the price of pasta. Eight things of pasta. $13.89. Okay, let's go see if there's anything we can't live without in the snack aisles, and then we will be done for today. $9.79. I just saw someone with flip-flops on. I'm not brave enough to do that. It's so cold out. I just saw another person in sandals, but at least this one had socks on wool socks on with her sandals. This is one of Mark's favorite things I have ever bought him, a Wi-Fi weather station. He has it in his closet, so he always knows what the temperature is outside. $49.99, it's on sale right now. He loves that thing. I came back up to the front for snow pants. I found one pair in his size, and now I'm afraid it's not even gonna be his size. We'll try them. All right, I think we're done. Do you think we spent? Make sure you stick around to the end of the video to see our total for today's shopping haul and to see what we would have spent if we bought all those staple groceries that we're comparing to Megan. Uh, she sent me her list of groceries and some of the price differences were kind of shocking. So make sure you go check out her channel 
after the video as well. Now back out into the cold to load up the groceries. Alaska cars get so dirty in the winter. My car needs a car wash so bad. I usually join like a monthly subscription car wash in the winter time. I never do that in the summer because we just wash our car outside, but in the winter time, it's dirty and hard to wash it in the cold. <laughs> Well, I survived getting my groceries in the car. It feels like it's warmed up. Let's see what the car says. Car says 14 degrees. My phone says one degree. <laughs> I'm not sure which one to believe but it definitely has warmed up it was negative four when i went in and the sunshine must have warmed up the car i don't know i just saw something very interesting as i drove around the parking lot they had two air pressure tire pressure like air stations i'd never seen those before and you scan your costco card it said free for members only so you scan your card and you can pump up your tires that was a new thing i've never seen that before probably got tired of people like wanting to pull in. I always saw people pull up and have them uh, filling up their tires. Now you can just do it on your own. Oh, that sun's bright. Got to pay attention. I backed into the garage today to unload. It's just too darn cold outside to do it. It's back down to zero once I got to my house. So going to get everything upstairs, go pick up the boys from school and then do a haul for you. Miss Luna came to watch mom bring up all the groceries. Hi. Yeah, hi. Come here. Hello. How are you? You okay? Okay, I'm gonna bring in the rest of the groceries. You make sure that I got the right stuff, okay? Hello, Everett. How are you doing? Good. Our Costco video friends have not seen your special announcement yet. What? Smile. <gasps> we know some of you just come for the Costco video, so we thought we'd share that. I'm a good person, yeah. You are a good person. Okay, so we ended up with three bananas in varying degrees of yellow. Cucumbers, peppers, lettuce, and butter. Uh, we had this in Hawaii and it's really good. I love these salad kits for lunches. Apples. This bread for like toast and making ham sandwiches. We make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches out of this bread. I have not bought grapefruits in a long time. My kids love grapefruits, so we'll be excited to have those. Some cauliflower, mayonnaise, Mom, whipping cream. Also, Dad like, loves I, grapefruit. Dad loves grapefruit too. I love grapefruit. We all love grapefruit. I do. Don't. I can smell the grapefruit. Okay. I don't. If you haven't tried these yet, they're our favorite. Make some heroes out of moose meat and grab some more tortillas. These are actually locally made tortillas from Taco Loco, is a local Alaskan factory. Grab some mangoes for a little Hawaiian breakfast we're going to. Chocolate chips and some tomatoes. We're switching up the cheese and got some Tillamook, Colby Jack, and Monterey Jack. Three things of meat because it said it was $5 off, which is pretty much half price. Crunch rollers for lunches. And better than bouillon in both beef and chicken. Grabbed some pickles. Some of these lentils, because they were so yummy. Uh, had those as a sample today. They're microwavable, just could be used a lot of different ways. We stocked on eggs. And pancake mix, and then these Bundaberg uh, ginger beers we'll use for like a game night or a movie night or something special over the holidays, and then some go -Gurts. Here we've got some scissors. I don't know if I needed these. I'm gonna actually look around and see if I can find my scissors before I decide if I'm gonna keep these, but really, scissors just disappear if you have kids. So these are for giving holiday gifts to teachers. Uh, I bought these and then the child that lost them found them. 
is. Yeah. Did you find yours? Yes. Yay. I want to try these. You can try those ones on, see how they I fit. Don't, don't, don't pull that off yet. We, we've got to just try them on, see how they fit. Wouldn't be bad for you to have two pairs, but now that I'm opening them up, they do look kind of small. And then this is for Everett. Guess what it has? Pajamas and a robe. A robe. I got a robe. I got and it. you get a robe. I wish I got How do those feel? Well. Westy? I got the blue ones so that you could tell them apart from other people's. And this we could write your name on them. They look a little bit short, but it looks like we can loosen them just there, here. And then I did end up getting this fresh 28 inch wreath and my car smelled like Christmas. I loved it. Let's put these away before they disappear into bellies. The total for today's Costco haul was $359.63. You look great in your little robe. I want to tie it up. Okay. It might not be a tie. You put it through, you just put it through by your belly. You take this one over the top and put it through by your belly and then pull it out. There you go, that's how you tie. And then you pull both sides. There you go, that's how you tie. <laughs> you did it. But it also has a, a hood. A hood, yes. So if I, my head gets cold and I'm sleeping outside in the winter time and I'm camping, I, if I bring this, I can, I can do that. Perfect. Okay, the second total for today, if I bought the 24 items that are showing up around here, kind of staple items that we wanted to compare, my total would have been $306.66. Make sure you go over to Megan's channel on Planting Birches to see what those 24 items cost where she lives or pretty comparable items. Thank you so much for being here. We are so grateful for each and every one of you that spends time with us. We love you, we're grateful for you, and we'll see you again real soon for more of